Good morning, Centurions. Today's lunch is whole grain stuffed crust pepperoni pizza with North Carolina's farm to school broccoli or marinara cup and fresh apple slices. Today's weather is sunny with a high of 72. Don't forget that flipping water bottles can be dangerous to your health or at least earn you a murder. Did you know that Snoopy has appeared as a giant balloon in the Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade more times than any other character in history? On this day in history, in 1863, Lincoln traveled to Gettysburg. As we continue in Peanut Butter Lovers Month, did you know that astronaut Alan Shepard brought a peanut with him to the moon, thinking that it would give NASA good luck? Did you know that type 1 diabetes serious effects include kidney failure, blindness, nerve damage, heart attack, stroke, and pregnancy complications? As we continue in Lung Cancer Awareness Month, did you know that cancer of the lungs takes more lives every year than breast, colon, and prostate cancer combined? Our basketball teams will play at East Lee on Monday. Come out and support the Centurions. Our Christmas tree fundraiser ends today. Today is your last day to submit forms and money. Our canned food drive lasts until December the 2nd. We need... Some more donations to help out our neighbors in need. Don't forget, there's a $75 prize to the winning homeroom. Have a great, great day, day Centurions. Today, continuing our teacher spotlight, we have Miss Oakley. What inspired you to start teaching? I got a free scholarship to go to college to teach. I was going to be a pharmacist, but that didn't work out. <laughs> what college did you go to? I went to UNCG in Greensboro. Who was your favorite teacher as a kid? Uh, my fifth grade teacher, Mr. Boswell. Because he was so much fun. I don't remember why. We had to do swish and spit, too. Every Friday, they'd come around with this little, like, mouthwash stuff, and they would squirt it in this cup, and you had to put it in your mouth and swish it around for 30 seconds, and then you had to spit it back in the cup and put your Kleenex on top of it. Every Friday. It was weird. I don't, I don't know why we did that. <laughs> What's Every your Friday. favorite book? Um, Miss hmm. Rupee is loopy. <laughs> Did you play any sports growing up? I ran cross country and track. What is your favorite place to go on vacation? Any place that is warm and sunny and sandy. If you could go anywhere in the world, where would it be? Once again, any place that is warm and sunny and sandy. <laughs> What's your favorite part of teaching so far? People like you and letting Paul and Chase have class together. <laughs> uh, What's your favorite sports team? Um, I have to pull for Carolina because my husband went to Carolina, and otherwise it's just me, me in the household, and that's not good. <laughs> How many years have you been teaching? Um, probably longer than both of y'all been alive. Combined. But what's your favorite animal? Um, doggies. Sweet puppy. <laughs> what's your favorite subject growing up? Subject? <laughs> <laughs> subject. My oh, good subject. Um, I just like school in general. School's fun. That's why I keep coming back every day. Who is your favorite athlete? Brandon Blackburn. Uh, what's your favorite animal? Rhinoceroses. <laughs> Rhinoceroses? Or hippopotamus it is. I want one for Christmas. <laughs> All right. Thank you, Miss Oakley. Thank you. Bye. Today we are back on Stone Street. Um, what's your name? Caleb Evans. What grade are you in? Seventh. What's your favorite sports team? Cincinnati Bengals. Where were you born? Pinehurst, North Carolina. Thank you.